Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. It's the boy. Um, <clears throat> so I made some changes. Um, I did some work as well. So instead of having that large base uh, scale, I decided to reduce the size of it uh, to this size. Uh, I, I did this so we got full connection to this, so it got better defense. Uh, less chance of it uh, breaking. Uh, we do have quite a bit left over on materials. Uh, not much, sadly. Uh, oh, and that's it. One more. There we go. And that's all the materials we can get so far. Uh, I'll dismantle that. Uh, yeah. Dismantle. Not more, and then that is it. Uh, uh, we'll put another thousand down for production. Um, then we will start getting some stuff together to start. Crafting some better uh, assembly equipment and all that. And for that, we need to try and sort out some kind of uh, production uh, area. Which I might use this as my own personal uh, mining. Not really special. I was just thought to double check because it does look a bit off that it might be just like fertilizer or something like that kind of look. Uh, right. Well, in that case, uh, trying to think of what to do. Uh, Pointless trying to repair tank because I literally do not have the ability to do that just yet. I think there's one message saying about the uh, mining stuff uh, where we can find uh, certain mining materials, which is definitely going to help with a lot of things. Uh, Uh, what do we need for a mining detector? Uh, or detector? Need 20 of those or things which we can't just get right now. Okay. Uh, what I'll do is this grab my vehicle and we will go and go somewhere where there's a mountainside and we'll just dig into it. Seems like the best idea at the moment. Ooh, this will do. So, uh, let's get part to somewhere just like round about here. And I think, let's see, we best to go here. Quite a 
out a lot of chunks very quickly um, and can cover a lot more than so the best option is to dig down um, <coughs> until you can get to like These are going to be very, very little to uh, resource. So we'll place these in there. And what we'll do is we'll just plant them again until uh, uh, the full storage is uh, full. As you can see, you'll get quite a bit of stone here. Tell you what, I'll turn that effect off uh, just for uh, I think it's, um, Now let's do play that one. Um, maybe on this way. Nope. Uh, nah, I think that's the only one which we need. Um, yeah, I think that's the only thing which we need. Um, We'll soon find out. No, it still does it. Um, I know there is a way to turn that effect off. Um, try that one. No. Inventory uh, I, I know there is a way to do it. I just can't remember the exact. Way to it. That makes sense. Uh, right. We do want to start going down, so if you want to get a better angle to go down, it is best to just crouch. Again, same with your uh, grinder, if you double tap the left trigger or whatever the trigger it is on the uh, right trigger. Um, it will uh, just run itself and can just continue digging um, until... I want to decide to listen up or to decide to go uh, to create a little crater where the rocks will fall. As you can see, the uh, rock chunks are starting to get a bit more bigger. Because we are getting to where it's a lot more denser location of materials. Um, now that's full, which is always great to see. Uh, 
So we've got one storage full. Uh, again, start again. And just repeat the process a number of times. Uh, I'm just going to literally fill my rover up and then. Uh, and see how much we can get from it. Uh, so we've got space for 9,012k in this. So. Okay. Let's do this a bit more better. There we go. Now let's tr crouch again, and this time we'll go uh, this way. can see the uh, stone chunks are starting to get a lot more bigger, a lot more uh, iron on ball. So we've got enough room to probably get one more load. And then that's it for the deal. Again, you still got the space in the cockpit, uh, which you can actually use as well. So let's uh, either jump in or we can just go here and see how much. So you can see we can fit quite a lot of materials in this. Which again is great because then you got uh, more room to carry and then you got your personal. That's maximum storage now. Uh, so we'll grab as much as we can. Uh, again, I'm not going to take too much because I know I'm not going to have uh, to use, so we're just going to get. Inventory. There we go. So now we are 100% uh, filled up. This will affect the rover because now it's a lot more heavier, a lot more dense, which it'll react to the way you got actually in the uh, vehicle. So more where you have, more uh, where you need, uh, more power you need to uh, get your vehicle to travel. And also, it means it's very easy to flip as well, which is a bit, uh, bit unsettling. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll just literally uh, reverse into this area. Again, uh, reducing the uh, work we need to do. Uh, we'll eventually get a connector because it will take a lot of materials to do that for now we'll just do what we can uh, let's see yeah. make sure I got enough room to do this so let's uh, get as 
Umarım. Çözürken ağda. As you can see, we gained quite a lot of materials uh, through this. We gained nickel. Uh, these will always uh, pop out with these. Uh, there's not much use in the main game for them, but there is uh, if you use certain mods, you can use them as uh, power or something like that to help yourself out. And it reduced the waste you got to throw out. Which, from where there's no way to destroy them properly. Well, uh, pretty much throwing it all out. Which can be a bit of a problem. It can cause a lot of issues with, uh, what do you call it? Uh, could cause a lot of issues with uh, a lot of the products and that. So now uh, we do need to. Uh, what we want to do is. What do we need to upgrade the assembler? Because that's the next thing we need to do. It's a normal assembler, which we need 10 uh, metal grades, which I don't know if we can make out of this. Uh, yeah, we can. Uh, we need the cobalt. Which, again, does not surprise me at all. Uh, so we do need to try and find this material. Uh, which is going to be quite difficult because we do need... Uh, uh, you, we need... 10 mal grids, uh, which um, is going to be slightly difficult. And where did this uh, miss game from? So, uh, as you can see, there's literally no way of uh, doing the grids. It's very rare item which you can get from a lot of things. But I'm just going to quickly look see if there's anything which we can get metal grids from, and I don't think there will be. No. I 
have anything in here? No, we do not. Right, we'll uh, see. I think there's. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm positive there's a storage unit across the bridge. We'll go there and see what we can find, if anything. That dismantle that um uh, base, I'm not sure. God, it's difficult to see right now. I don't think I think I already dismantled the storage area here. Find out. No, I have not. Across the bridge. Let's put all these materials in here for now. I'm not going that direction. I think that's a bit dangerous. Uh, I'm not sure. I think we're fine across the bridge, uh, but I'm not sure how far. I know there is a bit where you will start getting under attack by uh, turrets. But what we'll do is we'll take our time, get across, and then see, and hopefully uh, not get wiped out. Um, I got a feeling I'm going the wrong way. Oh well. Uh, I will take that time. Again, I don't have any source on this vehicle. No, there's some detection of uh, enemies there. Uh, so nothing in there. Um, access denied. So let's see. Lights, lights. Let's turn on the our torch. stuff in here so I'll grab these uh, items oh nice right. 
again. Uh, that's a basic one. So can we get this one? Uh, not too fuss about that. Now we can start building the uh, normal uh, assembler. this way because it will be a lot more quick up. And if we try to go around uh everything out of the assembler. Hopefully I got enough uh, materials to do this. If not then oh uh, everything going to go wrong uh, ooh, uh, just that one uh, that one I fired more. Uh, okay. Uh, plan B. Go back and then uh, see if we can get any more uh, resources. Uh, Plus, because it's not in a safe zone, uh, we don't need to worry about not being able to dismantle things. Again, always check the bed because you never know. Let's grab them. Go 
from my angle. Just a bunch of powers. I thought these might have uh, the English we needed, but nope. Certainly not. Um, I don't think there's anything on here which may have uh, the item which we need. If I go, that's good. Uh, oh, uh, oh. I know that's a bad idea. Uh, I know there's uh, turrets in that one. Uh, I don't know if there's any more building close by than that one. Um, that's the only one which there is. I guess there's that one over there. Um, which is an option. Um, we both know there's uh, some kind of satellite tower there, uh, and there's a building there. Uh, we already got stuff from there. Uh, Okay, uh, <coughs> we'll go across here um, if we can without, you know, blowing up. Because that one we already been, um, yeah. It's this one over here, which we are in B. down Oh, well, I like guess it's just in front of me. Yeah. Cause that's that one. Uh, yeah, so it just looks here in front of me. Okay. Uh, that should be. Nope. I need to. Just in case I need to use it or not. Oh, this is uh, and then uh, should be there. Yeah. Hmm. It's a lot more close than that. And it 
tried to just close it and not move past it. Yeah. Yeah. That's the reason why uh, there's a turret deal. So probably not the best idea of two coming up. So we'll this and go the other way for now. And it seems like the, the building above here, so we'll go to that one instead. Yee, hello. Uh, don't know if it's safe or not. Uh, can't tell. Uh, no, I'm not getting shot at, which is always a bonus. Now we'll turn it off. <clears throat> Let's turn it on. Let's turn it there. Uh, ooh, got iron ingots. I know it's not really much, but mm, it's better than nothing, I guess. So I'll put these in the vehicle. Um, and we'll get rusty bits from up here. There we go. Supplies, contracts, and uh, hmm. oh, I see it. All in contracts. Hmm. Say that uh, we can read it eventually. Uh, da, nope. And then up. I see the blue glass window. But, uh, huh. Like it's been damaged a bit. Mm. But yeah, we finally got the materials to upgrade the. Assembler to a normal one, and then we can. I guess we can see what we can get after that. Um, oh, uh, that was a bit risky. Ain't gonna lie, that was a bit. 
overlooking. One twenty stuff plates, um, which we definitely got. Uh, let's grab one of those. No, I'll put hundred in for now, and then need about eighty of those. Which, yeah. Uh, then uh, twenty motors. Can just need to make uh, another two. Displays. We've got five, so we'll just need another five. One, two, four, five. Uh, ten grids and uh, one twenty, one sixty computers. Uh, can make the majority of the stuff, uh, we just have a few bits which we need to craft. Um, we'll let's get them. Now, uh, first, uh, well, let's uh, dismantle this so I don't lose the items and get confused. Um, we'll put all these in here. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. Uh, got any materials and anything. Hopefully this doesn't uh, backfire on it. So I need the normal... Uh, <coughs> so I need 20... Uh, Uh. Oh, 
Fix that. Producing a lot more materials, a lot more abilities with the items which we've got so far, um, which is amazing. Uh, so, Ooh, okay. So, the reason why I'm dismantling it because I can't connect to this because it's on a weird angle, which the game does not like it. I don't get why this is a thing. And it's not these ones for like modules. It only connects in a certain way. It's really annoying. Um, So let's try this again, so we need uh right, let's go with yeah, I'll just put it there for now. Uh, we can say out uh another point. Uh, rebuild this and then I will be ending the video. Yeah, there we go. That's all done. So again, I got more stuff I can uh, do and also I got more stuff I can uh, so this is another thing you can do is literally put a blueprint in here and it will actually produce uh, how many you need for that specific item so uh, I'll just quickly turn this block off for now so it don't do it so if I do this it'll give me all the items which we need for that uh, specific Material. So, uh, if for instance, if I go like this, smaller blocks, uh, one of these, it'll do all them items at once. Which is where it's really under, because then you're not uh, trying to work out how much you need for certain items. You can just go, right, I need this, 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 and then it'll just do what you can with that. So as you can see, there's quite a bit of uh, items. So we've got flares, got uh, cancers and that. But also we can start getting lovely star tools, and we can dismantle all these. 
which is also great because of the item which we don't really need right now uh, um, how many of them do we have uh, two so yeah so we can just uh, do that uh, turn this back on and now it will dismantle all this and give us all these resources and it's also able to take these items so but anyway um, that's gonna be it for today uh, thank you for joining me uh, I do really appreciate any support you give me uh, but until next time guys see you guys in the next one